Problem 33, what is the length of TV in parallelogram STUV? Well, we could get all crazy and notice that we have two sets of parallel sides cut by transversals. We have congruent triangles. But what we really want to remember in terms of properties of a parallelogram is the diagonals of a parallelogram bisect each other. Bisect means cut into two pieces, two equal parts, because we have a parallelogram with diagonals, we know that let's call this point uh, Y. We know that TY is equal to YV. 7X minus 3 is equal to 5X plus 1. Subtract 5X from each side. 2x equals 4, x equals 2. Am I done? Well, did I answer the question? No, I did not. What is the length of t, v? 7x minus 3, 7 times 2, 14 minus 3 is 11. 5 times 2 is 10, plus 1 also equals 11. That is my check to see that I did all the arithmetic correctly. So the length of T V is TY plus YV is equal to 22. Which graph represents a circle whose equation is this? Which graph? Well, how about I determine the, the, what the graph looks like? Graph a circle whose equation is this. What do we know about circles? We know that the equation of a circle with center H, K, and radius r, the equation of that circle is x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. But here we just have x squared. What does that mean? because the equation should be x minus h squared. What does that mean? That means h is equal to 0. So the center of this circle is at point 0, y minus k squared. So k must be 2. And the radius is equal to the square root of 16 is 4. So if I had to graph this, this particular problem, the way I would graph it would be the way I would graph it would be to plot the center at 0, 2, that's the center. My radius is 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. And with a really good compass, I could actually 
draw this particular circle, although I don't know that I want to take time to do that right now. On the other hand, it seems really fun to be able to draw circles. So maybe I'll just try it. Let's see. There's one. Here's another. You get the idea.